Good morning, Gina. Yes, good morning, ma'am. Okay, Gina, can you tell me about yourself? Yes, I'm Gina Espino. I'm 37 years old, married. I have one kid. Okay, I have a few questions for you to answer, so let's start. Yes, ma'am. Why do you want to work as a maid? I want to work as a maid because I have already an experience. Why you choose Malaysia when there is a lot of other country? I choose Malaysia because I think it is a nice country and have a good relation to other people. How are you qualified for this job? I'm qualified for this job because I'm hardworking and I think I have experience already. May I know what your educational level is? My educational level is I'm graduated a two-year course in Diploma in Agricultural Technology. What is your recent working experience? My recent working experience is uh, before in the Cebu Mitsumi and already in Kuwait in 10 years as a housemaid. Okay, do you have experience of taking care of baby? I have experience taking care of baby and other and adult one. How about elderly people? Also elderly people, I already have experience. Okay, do you have any other special skills? I have special skills only in cleaning and other gardening or haircutting. Haircut, okay. Yes. Are you willing to learn new skills? Yes, I'm willing to learn now. Are you willing to work with a family where the mother-in-law or any relatives stay together? Yes, as, as a choice of my employer, I do. Currently, are you still working now? No, mom. Do you know how to cook? Yes, I know. What sort of food can you cook? I cook and uh, some foods like uh, Arabian food, like salad or uh, I want to learn more, mom. Do you cook Filipino one. food? Yes, yes, I do work. Okay, how about other dishes like Chinese food? European, Indian food, and Malay food? Only in Chinese food, maybe in salad, like that. I'm willing to learn, mom, if my employer tell me to, to do that. Okay. Are you aware that you will have to do washing, cleaning, ironing, and cooking? Yes, I do, mom. Cleaning, from all, washing, okay. cooking. From all these house chores, like washing, cleaning, ironing, and cooking, which do you like most? I like most cleaning, mom, and washing. If ever you were selected to work in Malaysia, who will take care of your kid? Uh, the one who take care of my kid is my mother. You are not allowed to use handphone during working hours. Yes, I know, mom. You are only allowed to use handphone after you finish all the works and when going to bed. Yes, ma'am. I use that. You are strictly needed to surrender the handphone to your employer in the morning and your employer will return back to you once you're going to bed. No, it's okay for me about that, ma'am. If ever your employer finds out that you're abusing of using your handphone and it's affected your work performance, your employer will confiscate your handphone and you are not allowed to hold it anymore. Instead, your employer will allow you to call to your family three times in a month. You are only allowed to bring normal phone and you are not allowed to bring smartphone. Are you agreed for the terms and conditions? Yes, ma'am, I agree the terms and conditions. Are you agreed to the rules and regulation for the handphone? Yes, ma'am, I agree. How many years is the contract as you agreed and understands? Two years. How, okay, can you describe for me your ethics, your attitude? I'm hardworking, diligent, and honest, and faithful to my employer. 
How can you assure to us that you will work hard in Malaysia? I assure that because I have already an experience and I do my best. Can you promise not to use the telephone without the permission of your employer? Yes, I promise I cannot do use my telephone without the permission of my employer. Can you promise not to put on makeup but to dress properly while work? Yes, I promise to dress properly during work time. Can you promise not to invite friends and relatives without the consent of your employer? Yes, I promise. Can you promise not to ask for advance salary from your employer under any circumstances? Yes, ma'am. I promise I do not ask any advances of my employer about my salary. Do you really understand of the rules and regulation of the agency? Yes, I understand the rules of agency. Do you pay any placement fee for you to come to Malaysia to work as a maid? No, I cannot pay for any any money for agency. Do you have any history of sickness, breast cancer, or any other illness? Yes or no? No, ma'am. Do you suffer from any skin diseases, allergy, or physical defect? No, ma'am. Have you suffered from any serious illness? No, ma'am. Do you smoke? No. Have you undergone any operation? No, ma'am. Are you medically fit? Yes, I'm medically fit. Are you in any medication? No, ma'am. Are you allergic with any food? No, I have no allergic about that. Are you preferred to work for the employer of any race? Yes, I'm prepared to work, ma'am. Are you preferred to eat the type of food taken by your employer? Yes, I, I eat. Are you afraid of being left alone in the house? No, I'm not afraid, ma'am. Are you afraid of dogs or other pets? No, I'm not afraid. Can you promise to work according to instruction from your employer? Yes, I promise to do any instruction to my employer. Do you have any immediate family working in Malaysia? No, ma'am. Okay, Gina, we have finished our question section. Let's go to case study. I have a case study for you and I want you to answer me truthfully, okay? Yes, ma'am. Upon arrival in Malaysia, within six months, if ever any of your family members passed away, what will you do? Only I giving financial support and only I call them. Okay, tell us about yourself and why do you want to work in Malaysia as domestic helper? I, w I want to work as a domestic helper for Malaysia because uh, I know I have already an experience and I know a Malaysian people, it's very nice, very good rating to other people. Okay, Gina, what do you want to tell to your employer who are watching your video right now? Mom, first of all, uh, I hope you like me so and what you want, I do all the, all the rules and regulation you want, then I follow. And I do my work as my best. Okay, thank you very much, Gina. We will update to your agency if there is any selection made by the employer. Okay, ma'am. Thank you so much.